everyone, and welcome to another episode of Newscast. My name is Sam Healy, and in these videos, we tell you all of the latest news about our projects as well as the company. As always, if you don't want to watch the entire video, you can skip to the parts that interest you by utilizing the timestamps in the description below. For general news today, this will be the last newscast episode for this foreseeable future. I'm having elective weight loss surgery on Wednesday this week, and I'm unsure how recovery will affect my ability to record and edit things. So Leo and I decided it would be best to make this episode of Newscast my last. So I do want to make sure I thank everyone for watching each episode that's been put out thus far. This is our 107th episode. It's been quite a ride, and I enjoyed producing every episode for you. Depending on how I'm feeling on Thursday, the day after my surgery, I may or may not be doing another live play or a Q&A this week. But I will definitely not be doing a video on Friday this week as we are going to pick up our new puppy from the breeders that morning. This is Strider and he is a chocolate lab and our newest family member and we can't wait for him to come home. I will, however, do my absolute best to make sure that I do something on Thursday, June 30th, as this will be my last day with the company. So be on the lookout for that. Now, we do have some more news on a few of our projects this week, so let's get to those. For Darkest Dungeon this week, we have great news that the Paris office and the designers have received their first copies of the game. Nick and Helena were gracious enough to share their unboxing photos with us, so enjoy. <laughs> Now, Leo is planning on doing a live unboxing of the copy sent to the Paris office during his live Q&A tomorrow, so make sure you show up for that. For Enchanter's Darklands today, we're pleased to announce that the print proofs have arrived from the factory and are currently being proofread, checked for content, and approved. This is a major step forward in the production process. Once the items are approved, we can give the green light to the factory to begin mass production, which means we get that much closer to being able to ship your pledges out to you. Along that line, we're still anticipating shipments to the hubs beginning in Q4 of this year. For Anastir today, we wanted to make sure to let you know that we are hearing your comments and posts about the costs of shipping from the pledge manager. We know it's a bit of a shock, but please be sure that we are not ignoring your responses or your questions. We are basically in the process of preparing an in-depth overview of the historical subsidization and freight cost rises that have prompted this increase. Please bear with us as we seek to gather the necessary information and we'll make sure that we cover this situation as clearly as we can in the very near future. Now remember that Leo will be live tomorrow at 6 p.m. GMT, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on our YouTube channel with a live Q&A in English and at 8.30 p.m. Paris Time with a live Q&A in French. So tune in if you have any questions or if you just want to see what wonders he might be able to show because you just never know what Leo might have up his sleeves. As mentioned earlier, I'll be doing the best I can to put out at least one or two more videos over the next couple of weeks. I'll schedule them on the channel when I'm able to do them, so keep an eye out for those too. That's it for today though. Once again, stay safe and play some games while you're at it. We'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Take care. <laughs>